Carlson versus Ailes is getting ugly. Gretchen Carlson is suing the man who hired her and fired her from Fox News, suing him for sexual harassment. Today, her lawyer said, quote, we are prepared, girding for the bomb that's going to fall on all of us. Benita Nyer has more on this. Hi, everyone. I'm Gretchen Carlson. So Former Fox News anchorwoman Gretchen Carlson said she was not the only woman sexually harassed by her former boss, Roger Ailes. A statement from her lawyer says many women have come forward to report similar sexist and harassing behavior by Mr. Ailes. Carlson alleges in the lawsuit that she was fired because she refused his sexual advances and complained about severe and pervasive sexual harassment. What a ride. Yeah, According to Carlson, those complaints were the reason Ailes replaced her from the highly rated morning show Fox and Friends in 2013. When Carlson, a Stanford graduate and former Miss America, accused other Fox employees of discriminatory treatment, she claims Ailes said, I think you and I should have had a sexual relationship a long time ago. In a statement to CBS News, Ailes denied the accusations. Fox News provided her with more on-air opportunities over her 11-year tenure than any other employer in the industry, for which she thanked me in her recent book. CBS News legal analyst Ricky Kleeman. Gretchen Carlson may have some real problems with her past statements about Roger Ailes. She has praised him in the past over and over again. Well, once you've put those things in print, once you've said those things out loud, it's very hard to say simultaneously, this boss, this brilliant boss, was sexually harassing me. Carlson's attorney says she was not allowed to speak to the press or publish anything, including her 2015 book, without Ailes' approval. Maurice, we should mention that Carlson is a former CBS News correspondent as well as an anchor. Vinita Denier, thanks so much.